Everybody and welcome back to a brand new stream. Does it work? Somehow my music volume isn't allowed to go back up again. That's odd. Oh, now it does. So that's a good start, I would say. So I'm gonna continue this game that I've been playing for quite a few hours already. Um, but I really wish to complete the game. Um, so get all the achievements in. And um, that means that I just have to do a couple of things. Um, which is increase the price sales to 25,000. So add another 10,000. Also, the train which will be coming through here needs to arrive another 100 and 42 times so i quite have the time to just expand my city because honestly i'm in love with this um let me change the screens a bit because now it's a bit uh, a bit of a much actually um this here is fine okay so this is my current current city and I'm absolutely in love with it. Um, I'm just gonna play and talk through every idea that I have because currently I was building here. Um, and we have a little library, a cinema, a museum, some offices because that all increases the value of the tickets. Um, but also, I really would love a common area right here and just green it up a bit because we have so much 
um, going on here of industry that we just want to keep it a bit green like we did here. Um, we have so much money. Uh, we've got all the perks already, so we don't have to think about that. Let's go to decorations. Let's see what we can add right here. Um, I wanted to keep it green. Maybe some hatches or hatches trees for the matter. Um, it's near the hill, so adding some trees is cool. But this is just all decoration because this absolutely does not increase the money. Um, for a single bit. Um, here, place residence and commercial place residences and commercial buildings to increase the ticket price. So, on this corner, maybe we can build like the tiny homes. Okay, so one tiny home is allowed. One tiny home. That's actually tiny. Oh, and let's try to decorate a tiny bit around it. But a large tree isn't allowed. I think three. Maybe some bushes or some anything. Come on. So a little tree here. And a tree here. Like we want to keep it like squeaky clean and everything. But we also want it to be a bit cutesy. even look at that makes it way more entertaining it's all about the little details in this game honestly it's really lovely to play it and now as I have more money and the whole freedom to build everything it's actually quite amusing to actually build it the way you want. Mm -hmm. You see all the lovely people waiting to leave again. They're all enjoying themselves so much. They're dancing and everything. It's so cute. And then you still have people walking around here somewhere. At least I hope there are. I don't see them actually. Probably because they're waiting for the train. Look, only a couple of people are still walking here. Oh yeah, and here. When you start up the game, it actually needs to load in everything. What happened here? I don't recall this being like this, but all right. Um, we can actually adapt to that. Do, do, do. An end. Look, now it looks more natural. Hmm. Not too shabby. Need to mess with some. create a bit of fun here so it would be like hilarious if you have a meeting and then go play a bit of bowling can i change colors sometimes it doesn't respond that well i want it in the same colors as the buildings and as this is so fun we also um, to decorate this a bit further at least I would really like that um, oh this doesn't fit here it's also too big I think yes it's too broad 
Uh, we can add a couple of parks. Oh, or is the one that I want? This one? It's too big even. Hmm. Then we have to move to this one. Let's give it a two. Let's create a double piece like this. So there's enough seating room. So if everybody wants to gather at the park, there is some space. actually add a fountain I hope no it's too big already no oh, you can actually rotate like that as well if we can just make a path like that um, because I really am a fan of these you will see it like, literally throughout my whole town is really suiting here though we can add a bit of a oh garages of course because we're nearby um, offices offices so actually some parking places would actually make a lot of sense it's not like the best um, for looks, but I'll take it for today. Yes, this is not allowed. And then we can decorate it a bit in between. I actually realize now that my hair seems vaguely <laughs> colored because of how the light shines through. still finding where you're able to um, actually place them at least I'm still struggling with that in this game um, but I'm also like need to learn to change up the colors here and there to make it more diverse you can actually even make it a whole different uh, vibe with the blue trees haven't tried that yo haven't tried because okay, you can also go for a bit of dark green here and there which is actually pretty cool 
But here I like it in the green area. And here I also quite like it. I think this is all fine. This is, this is fine. Mm -hmm. But here it's kind of gives it a better dimension. Oh, it's all bored. Look, and then your village to go away and these enter your town. It's so adorable. Look at these birds. Honestly, the detail in the birds is like what? I don't quite know why these sometimes don't want to change color. I think because we're in it the wrong way. It's really because of the um, the borders. That it sometimes acts a bit strange. I don't know why. Well, it's because of the borders, but I don't know what causes it. Mm. Someone's sending me like a list of games, and I am a soccer for people telling me uh, new games so I really need to copy paste that give me a second uh, da -da -da. so these are all games and the oh no can I do it like this and then no it doesn't understand well This one did it perfectly well. All right, that means I have a bit more to do in a second. So I'm really wondering though. Oh, this is actually the end border. I thought it would be fun to like put a couple of houses here, but don't think uh, that will be the case for today. So we all got this part ready, so I'm kind of debating, am I going further in the back, this section? Or actually do I want to expand here? Because these areas are quite fun with all the squiggly, squiggly ways. So let me just build some roads actually. Um, so it would quite make sense to... some residential here alongside and I think this will become a bit more like stores because I do have let me see the barber here the coffee shop here um, so that's all pretty fine so I'm gonna start with residential because residential ups are money and we want more money more money so really obsessed with these cute little ones can actually add some uh, we can actually add two more here look at that that's cute so I believe um, how big is we have a house which is a garnet hut these are so cute then we can add a little back porch to that and it's just matching with everything here and um, the only thing that is the slightest thing that puts me off is that the skills are not 100% matching um, because look at this and then look at that right it's it's kind of mismatched I don't know um, what the idea was with the developer for actually um, making it like that 
uh, I just don't pay too much attention to it because it will kind of like annoy you in the end because okay this is all not well you have this and this and this and this is kind of in the same aesthetic but this would only have like a bed and everything just like in um, what's that game called again the tenants you have these little houses that is just one bed right um, Do, 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 do. So, I think I make an inner porch. So, these townhouses are adorable. Let's put just three in there. Um, and then we have the garden, but we also have the family's home. Could put that there and then we just put another small house next to that let's, let's call it a tiny home because that's really cute but as you can see the scales are just not 100 percent but we can now add a lovely tree house in the back again for skill it doesn't quite make sense um, and then we can add some tiny trees because then the backyard is just a cute little porchy area which is just so adorable and we can but the fun thing with this game is that you can actually change the grid that you want to place items so for instance i can put it on one so you can put it at every and you can put it at a two and then it's waivers put three and four so that is actually a feature i really appreciate you can just click on every place and hold this you have a bit of room to place these items down and then you have your little flower patch yeah. and then i hope i can add some trees if we put it at four look then you can easily easily put some trees down there look at that it's just so cute um i don't believe that where is it we have this section is too big right so we're gonna place some different trees giant willow we love a good willow look at that it makes it so much lively bam, bam, ba -da -da. the desktop audio is a bit too loud so so now we still have some availability of space here but i really hope it is somewhere no. look at that look at that everything is perfectly well fitting Oof. <laughs> Random person popped up. Did you see that? Cute. So now we've got another little section over here, which is actually more of a inside porch. But I'm gonna put some tiny houses here and maybe even expand that here if I'm able to. So it's up to here, and then we take oh, an end point make that here and i actually want to go within with the tiny houses those are my favorite residential houses wait what i swear it just caught it for a second it's so weird hmm dun, 
You just see that sometimes. Because this should be allowed easily. Oh. Well, let's first place this one down. This one. Let's first place down what we can place. Um, we also have these ones. I don't think I've placed these down yet. And then we have these cuties. We also have the little high one. Which we can perfectly fit here. But as you can see, this doesn't bring up the money that much because they are cheaper houses. So, yeah. It's kind of sad, actually. So we kind of have more residential area. Now we can actually also... Hmm, let me put on a bit of light. Not so bright though. We don't need that much brightness today in our lives. Uh, we still have so many. I think I will create an idle game whenever I need to reach 250 trains. Because we are not able to pull that off. Um, let's go back to decorations. What? Why is this allowed? When I could have placed a house down there. <laughs> Look, this is not allowed. This is allowed. Oh, I actually like planters. So let's chuck it down with some planters. This is actually quite cute. Nothing wrong with that. Mm, or is there? Okay, so this is not allowed. But is this? It is. It is what it is. Yeah, nice. Okay, so at this point, I would assume that we can put a little bungalow here. So when you're at the end of the road, there's still a little house to be rented. Oh, and this is suddenly fine to place down. I would say so. Mm. There was something like a small bush, right? Small bush. Just a little decoration here and there. Okay, this is fully not allowed, but cute. So now we go back to commercial. So I don't think we're actually. Oh, we have one right here. The cinema isn't needed. Uh, we can easily put a little hot dog or dew in here. Yeah, always place it wrong. I don't know. I actually don't know for this point. Anyway, the hot dog or dew. Can we put a seating place? As it is by the water, I think. This would be quite fitting to have like a restaurant and then you can go back there. Mm. Mm. And that's so close by the water, it would be so cute to just get a little ice cream and some fries. No, I didn't want to chase that. I wanted to chase that. I actually like the pink one. I don't say that a lot. But can you imagine living next to an ice cream hole? That, that's, that's tough. A blossoming tree. I don't think I placed these enough. So let's place a couple. This little backyard area for these lovely 
I don't know what these little silly things are called. I don't believe they have a name. But yeah. Do -do -do -do. Oh, we have a kind of outsider. Look how cute that is. I want to take a screenshot of that because that is just amazing. Do, 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 do. Give me a second. Do. <laughs> uh, look, all these people. Little biker. Extra thousand every time the train arrives. Oh, but now we're already at 16k. We only need another 9k. Can we accomplish that with all of this? It's quite a bit of space, isn't it? You should think so. We'll see. Also, I should make some rules here. Where will this road lead us? I don't know. This road for sure nowhere. So this will be a cutoff point. Look at that! Whoop. That is pretty, pretty nice. So we can actually expand. Because this was all bungalows. This was just tropical houses. I would love some more beach houses actually. That would be great. Hmm. Are you? You are kidding me, right? here I guess because we kind of have to change the thing or two wow this was such a good little place this is actually kind of sad we can place some more residential here which will be fine like with zero doubts this is beautiful as well but this needs to turn again and then I want a seating area over here yes 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 yes, yes. look at that little commercial poop Mm, I don't know. We just want some roach. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Starting to look like something. love some beach houses i wanted to have some beach houses over here so let's troop to this side and look where the beach houses are oh yeah here. where so these are the perfect locations for beach houses here we don't fit anyone and here also not so we actually have place for 
two whole beach house. <laughs> oh lord. Lord, 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 lord. Uh, trying to find some inspiration actually. But not a lot of people play this. Mm. Oh wait, this needs to go in my pen case before I forget. Sometimes I have really random thoughts and I think I shouldn't forget this and I immediately need to do it. Otherwise I will forget it. Okay, this can fit in here and this can fit in here. Literally, I have a pencil case. A huge pencil case given to me by a friend. Um, and I have so, in comparison to my face, I have so much stuff in this. It's unreal. It's unreal. But I have four um, sticky notes, post-its. I even have paper clips. I have multiple washi tapes. I have tea packs. I have too much. Too much. Okay, I will put on a background light because I don't like the lighting on my face. But the best currently is I have a little uh oh, the camera funny dog for whole skeleton on there. Because he had a skeleton period. Ooh, that's a bit better lightning. Bit of lightning darling. But uh ooh. Can I walk? Ooh. Look how pretty my city is. Look at the birds. Okay, the programming of the birds isn't the greatest. I really wonder how I look myself. You even have like whether you walk. I wonder. Okay, so you are not allowed on structures. I want to go there. Look at the bird. Big surf champion. Youth. So this is all in my head for rental. Okay, so you do have, you do see the other houses. Well, okay. These are the very tiny homes. <laughs> this is a whole row of tiny homes. <laughs> it looks so funny like this. And then we have the little, well, in a little. Oh no, here we are, we weren't allowed to place anything, right? Uh, oh, this is the campus area. Cool. Even with the volleyball and everything. Are we allowed to... Ooh, boink. That's so cool. This should be a hidden achievement that you would touch like the ball. This is amazing. Oh, you even have the sound. I'm really blown away by this first person mode. Sims 4 could not. Oh. Okay, the houses in the south don't have sound. The little playground. It's so cool. Okay. But I was busy building that raid. Can I run? I can run. <laughs> yeah! Da -da 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 -da. I'm super fast, super fast, just to die for breakfast. Look at that. Look at the library. It's so cool. This could be a game in itself. The hot dog arenas, the barbershop. This is actually prime freaking downtown. Ooh, and a park. Okay, but blown away actually. Where was I walking? 
here. I was hoping here. That's so cool. That's actually pretty amazing. Oh, I wanted to go here. Can I? Uh, how did I do that? Uh, first person. Neighbor info. First. Okay. Oh, this is the uh, main hall, right? So we'll go back because we want to take the main road. Shoo! Oh, all these seating area is so cool. Ah! Look at that. You can see that this is all being built. Lol. Then we go all the way to the back. <laughs> here you have kind of a loose area. Fair enough, I should build something here. And here you can, oh. Let me see. Oh yeah, this is, you can rent this. Nice, these are some regular houses. pretty cool it's pretty nice yeah I like that yes nice I wanted to green up this bit <laughs> Okay. So this should look a whole lot better now when you walk past this. Um, and we can also try to put as many trees here as possible. put it down there it would be amazing we have no freak <laughs> that's room for a tree act normal one so a bit more green hey Bernard how are you doing thank you for joining the stream I am playing Polyville Canyon this is a longer house than I want. I want a single family. Hmm. It would be fun to build some riverboat houses here. I am doing fine. A bit tired actually, but nothing new for that. Hey, Yvette. Mm. <laughs> How are you all doing? I imagine <laughs> hi <laughs> I imagine you're enjoying your weekends very much <laughs> Not, the light is a little bright let's cannot go any lower um, today we're building a beautiful city very <laughs> big well this one isn't that big I go to my original town, um, which I started off a couple of hours ago. This is my original town, quite large. Um, but this one, there's like no single spot left. So I am going to the rivers and enjoying building there. I've come to realize that I should also probably build a hospital and everything around there. 
Hmm. Maybe I have some space right there. Uh, hospital? Hospital? Ooh, perfectly right on the corner. And I would like a fire department. Please. Thank you. And I also would like a police station. Uh, it doesn't fit in as <laughs> it doesn't fit perfectly. Hmm. Maybe we should turn this. No. Align this. That's prettier. Also increases your money quite a bit. Ooh, I can play Two Point Hospital. But I actually want to do that when I increase my streaming days when I go to Twitch. Because I might have around two to three streaming days then. So one will be Minecraft. One might be Two Point Hospital, and one might be Stardew Valley, but I'm not sure yet. Still debating on that. I think I want to play those three games. So, will you watch them? <laughs> will you watch it? Um, when I'm gonna play that? I really love it. Okay, that's too big. By the way, this game is one euro and fifty cents or something. I believe one euro and fifty nine cents. So it's so much worth the buy. I would definitely pick this game up if you're <laughs> okay. If I um, I think not in September but in October I can increase the streaming days. So, whenever I do, I will let you know when I stream um, Two Point Hospital. Because that's gonna be epic. What have you guys been doing today? Mm, I guess. Mm. Ooh, a parking space. It will make sense. How many can I put down? Whoop whoop! This actually makes quite sense near the hospital and every job related thing. Um, I think something like. Some office. Oh, the office doesn't fit. Okay. We went for a walk in Ramsfair and also had a barbecue with my. Oh, that's really cool. I got dragged to the riverside because I didn't want to go, but the boyfriend wanted to go. So I actually got dragged <laughs> and we needed to bike there and then we sit there and it was really hot and I don't like sun. So it was really <laughs> salty. I didn't want to go. And then when I was there, I sat in the shadow and I was a little bit better. So then I didn't want to leave and go back in the sun to bike home. So I was really being dramatic. <laughs> I was being really dramatic. <laughs> but I survived. And tomorrow is the first day of the academic year. And I don't want it because I'm still tired of last year. So. Um, I'm not feeling tomorrow or this week or this whole year. I actually don't. It sounds like an adventure. For my boyfriend it was to deal with my... <laughs> my temper. <laughs> because he was kind of like not planning on where we should go. And because of that we... He didn't know where we were going, but I was really salty because it was sunny, it was hot. Um, he said like, um, let's go now. And I was like playing with my hamster. I was like, 
wait you mean now now like i need to dress up and we actually go in in five minutes so i was really so salty so salty <laughs> but i survived and i doubt if i can do it because i looked at the amount of data that i need to work through by hand and i got really sad <laughs> and i did i don't want to start the year i'm just very much in denial and yeah but i chose my um like in my final year you have like these um day like you have to follow six class days how they call it um teaching days six and you can pick your own topics because there's like a little list um and then you can um specialize if something you want and i basically um i still have to do one um how would you say it you need to um ask if you can go to that specific class it's with like forms and everything and i've applied to five of the days of the six um but the last day wasn't yet in the list it didn't have a final date is it now because i'm gonna specialize in more hospital related topics and there's just one topic left but they didn't have oh no they still don't have it so i'm gonna do radio pharmacy um care uh selling so the cost of care pharmacy on the intensive care unit toxicology and veterinary pharmacy like for animals which is pretty cool i guess because i've had moments that you have medication for cats or dogs because that is like given in a regular pharmacy which i didn't know and then you always have to like i've got the medicine for the cat named i don't know little little snoozy or something or from the cat for patient it's really weird and i have no clue on how to check if the medicine dosage, dosage is correct because i would fuck know how animals work i mean they live but i don't understand the physiology of an animal so i'm also gonna follow those classes it's gonna be really weird <laughs> To get that topic change and if it is yes it fits here that's cool because mm. then they also can go here but we also need a bit of green because i think i think it's a bit bland here i think just some hedges would do actually Bam, bam. Seriously? You can, are not allowed to have anything. Give me that poster. Sure, I will. On the fact that I'm gonna do medicine for animals? I mean, I guess. I can do that. But I see everyone, like, from university going to other countries. I'm very confused that everyone is just doing their thing over there. Because a lot of people are actually going abroad. And I didn't expect that. So many people. This really bugs me. Hmm. Can I... Hmm. 
This is better. I guess. I want a full row. Du, 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 du. Is it beautiful? No. Do I care? A little bit. <laughs> yes, like that. Ba -da -ba -ba. Because behind there I'm only gonna put a lot of trees to make the neighborhood more green. Because, but because this is more of a company based stuff, I don't want the houses to be bothered by that. And I believe we had, yes, the pine group. Everyone who has watched The Night Manager knows that Pine is also the surname of the main actor or the main character, if you would prefer to say it like that. So every time I say Pine, I think of something completely different. And if you haven't watched The Night Manager, you should, because you're actually Wasting on. Ooh, Sif says. Why Sif six says six? Why Sif six and not five? Or did you rather want six? Did you like it more? Hold on, one second. Everything is breaking. I think I have the wrong key bindings. It had discount. Ooh! Did 6 have a discount and 5 didn't? Really? That's so strange. Hmm. 6 is also good though. I don't know. Do I own 6? I don't even know. I have so many Civ games. I do have Civ 6. I've played it for 15 whole minutes. Maybe we can play it all together once. If you guys are up for that. Oh, you bought uh, like the complete version. Is it that much on sale? For Which version did you buy? Because I see the Civ 6 for 60 euros for 8.99 and then I see the uh, the Platinum edition was 100 euros and that's now for 10 and then you have the um, 140 euro vision for 26 Oh yeah, so you bought the huh. Complete your collection. Hmm. I don't know. Platinum. Yeah, so that was only 10 bucks. I don't know, I have 6-6 six, six and... Do I have DLC? I thought I had. I don't know. Yes, I have three DLC. I oh no. I have the Viking scenario, the Austria civilization and scenario, and the Aztec civilization. I think I got that free once. I don't know. I just know I have it. But then we should um, plan a date. We should plan a gaming date. We don't have a Discord with the four of us, do we? Look at the freaking bird. Bird! Actually, so, so pretty. It's a way too pretty bird for the game. 
it's very it's own it's not that um poly actually uh, the only pain is the scrolling because i'm doing like a whole well i don't think it's just the four of us i think it was together with more people uh don't even know if i'm still in it Oh, shall I make that? Uh, we did have one, but not with Ethan. I cannot find it. I only see the newbies um, Discord, but that's with a lot more people. Yeah, newbies. But that's with more people, right? Because I see some... This is all Overwatch servers. Is Yvette actually playing Two Point Hospital? I see it on Discord. <laughs> yeah, I'll make um this work tonight. Ooh, which level is she in? She can does she know? Can she check that? By the way, if she ever needs advice on two point hospital, please let me know because I haven't finished the game like fully with all the DLC, but I finished the whole main game with three stars. So. Oh, you sent us something on WhatsApp. Oh no, but that's not like a server. That's like a private call. So we didn't have our own server. So I'll make a server. That's fine, I'll do that. Um, whiff, I need to put some lifeguards in between because these are the, um, the little uh, river houses and then we have some life saving. You can sit behind here, you can rent a boat here. I sent it you, uh, she had a two star hospital. That's really nice. Um, they're always clustered in lef three levels, so one to three, and then you move to the next area. Let me know if she has the name of uh, the hospital she's in. I would really love to know how far she... Wait, maybe I can even see it with achievements. No, I will, I will make the server in a bit. Where is Two Point Hospital? Um, view profile. Oh no, I cannot see um, how far she is. Sad. Only if I go in game. Mm -hmm. But it's so fun, like, oh, lower bollocks, nice. Now you're still very in the beginning, right? Lower bollocks. Uh, that's so nice. If she ever needs hints or tips on how to complete certain levels please just call me call me please the game is like my obsession my actual actual obsession hmm. the main one what i'm gonna do with this part I'm talking a lot but i'm also thinking Thinking! 
Oh, we could put some benches down here. That's really cute. Um, and then we can pave a road. Because you can also pave roads in this game. So then you go back to here. Bam, bam. <laughs> I'll never worry. So here we can put a bank, I think. Here's the station. Yes, a bank would be quite cool. River bank. Beautiful red. Um, I don't feel like putting schools here. Maybe another post office just to get your daily stuff because this all living area. Um, maybe also some stores. Or even for the kids, maybe a huge arcade would be so much fun. Quite fitting, quite next to the bank, because then you can actually get your money and then waste this on so many games. Um, I'll also put down two more information stations. Mm. We can actually put some offices down here. Kind of belongs to the safety of the the people. Uh, let me see. What do I want next? So I believe a cinema is already close by, isn't it? Yeah, this is a cinema. So maybe a restaurant, though. I hope that the dev is gonna put more items in the game because we only have the um what is it called uh, a roadside diner and gifts we have a sushi shack but i think a regular steakhouse or a vegan restaurant will really fit in here uh, and we might want some entertainment that is this is a more addition to the entertainment nook because here we have a um some entertainment but here this is really centered um, the coffee house yes feeling it big bakery let's go really don't like the colors of the bakery i cannot help it and a little gaming nook look how cute it's becoming it's still under development, isn't it? I think, no, it's fully released, um, but I've talked to the dev and he's still like updating the game. I think this specific, uh, this specific version is 1.2. Can I see that? Oh no, that's not menu. Oh no, I cannot see it here, but I can see it. Oh. That's also funny. I scroll outside of the game and then this happens. Um, it's currently version 1.2, so it's not uh, better. But it's only been all updated in August. I believe it was released in May or something. So... I can't say it's in development, but I can still see he's working really really hard on it and i actually like the game i really 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 like it i want a pink donut oh no is it really pink it isn't um let's also put another hot doggery there hot doggery day look at that would you look at that um I think this one is way too big. Yeah. Doesn't fit. Maybe we can put some fancy residentials here. Some townhomes? Yes, it fits. Ooh, white townhomes. To fit closely. Oh, uh, high rise apartments. Don't do it here. Maybe just <laughs> squeeze it in there. It's just another boathouse. 
Now we're already at 17k. Okay, so this is actually filling quite up right now. We don't, we're already over the half. Let's finish this little part. Du, 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 du. Okay, so my achievement progress. Currently I am at 129. So that means we're another 111. No more, 21. But after that we also still have Polyville Island. That I still can fully, like, fully live the dream. But look how, how big that... Oh, no. Escape. I wanted to do this. This is huge. This is absolutely huge. Because it's just a blank. Like, damn. So, if I don't get 25k um, in this town... I will sure get it in the next town, but I actually really want it here. So I should put more expensive stuff down here, but I would say that some bungalows would be quite fitting. <laughs> That's so big. Like, this is the perfect spot for more bungalows. There's a fly here, my gosh. Can I fit another one? Yes. Okay, so this doesn't fit anymore. So then we color scheme these. That's cute. And then we can put down some palm trees. Palm trees. Yes. Yes, yes, yes. Hey. Ah. Look at that. It's kind of a tropical base again. But um, your girl is gaming. Um, what are you doing? Except for watching the stream. Bernard. I'm really obsessed with these. I cannot play, stop placing them down. So this would be cool if I put the high hatches again. Because then it's also a rental again, a rental space. Bam, bam, bam. Just watching the stream. Are you just vibing? I'm really happy, by the way, that um, we're going to the script. I'm really looking forward. Mm. So the garner didn't fit there. We can also put a couple of two of these. I'm gonna color them all the same. Yes. <laughs> park next to it mm. would you look at that this is adorable 
if the mountain lets me place everything. I really love the tropical vibes. Yep. <laughs> Ticket God. Well, he's quite handy in getting all the tickets, I'm not gonna lie. So we got this bar, this, 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 this. I'm gonna make another overshot, overview shot. So I'm really excited about this game. Um, so I might try to get down at this little curler area because it's not that much so it would be so fun to get the really expensive houses so let's see how many maisons we can fit in here look at that 28 per piece oh no So that is that, but it would be better if we just, yes, like that. Um, then the road, mm. get it up till here and then the rotation till here. And then we want some end pieces. Look! How cute is that? And then we go back to residential. Oh, we're already at the end. Some contemporary. Because we can make an additional road here. And then I don't want a contemporary home there. Hmm. Oh, it doesn't fit there. So sad. One does fit here. Okay, so this one is going to be that color. You are going to be that color and that color and you guys are good. So then I'm going to do another road because of course they want their own place, right? Because this is the more high end. We want a double road. And then turn it around here. So they all have the uh, their own little area. Can we put some trees in between here? So these actually are um, the somewhat lower class. Because as you can see, they have to share one road with the three of them. And these actually have separate um, areas for their own cars. Mm. Well, yeah, I don't quite understand why does this not line up. Yeah, now it lines up. Now it's way better. Look at that! This kind of the luxury area. Luxury! Mm -hmm. Boop. That doesn't make any freaking sense, but okay. I don't care. Can we put some green at the ends? <laughs> yes, we can. That's cool. Who are you? You're a tourist. He's just going at the rich people, the frick. That's kind of rude. 
It's kind of rude. Look, now I'm a little overlight. One crack. It's okay. I'm just neon white myself. I realize that. Try to fight a proper lightning. I don't have the background light on, but I think. He's going place. Oh, yeah, he is. That guy. He is already planning on stealing everybody's money. He's planning on owning the house. I actually like the residential areas in my last town. I didn't put much residential in. So I'm actually trying to get more residents in here. Which is actually so beneficial. I, and we cannot leave these little houses oh i really love these it puts 103 euros in the bank or dollars this game is dollars um we don't have a real brownstone area i believe and yeah, we have a couple here but the thing with the brownstone is i don't actually like the back of it these have windows in the back i think this is gonna be a little apartment complex area. Let's see how far we can get. Can this be put on? No. No, no, no. So, um, and then maybe we can put like This one here, I'm gonna rotate this. Oh, ah! Put like that. Can we give it a different color? Kind of like that. Um, but then you somehow want to like cover that up, and I think you need like the highest, like these. Uh, and then as many close together as possible. That's the only way I can place these brownstone houses because they're so massive. Like, hold on. Look, now they, you can look at the area, if you know what I mean. Did I place him that close by on the other side as well? Apparently. Yeah, now it's looked proper. Now we only need to put down a little road in front of it. Uh, that's not the right one. That's not the right one. This is the proper one. Hello? Seriously? Are you gonna be like this? Is he actually... Seriously? <laughs> That's what she said. That's pointy though. I don't quite understand why this works and the other f doesn't. And aligning in this game is still a bit difficult. That's quite neat though. I need to do the other side. So you can see that it doesn't actually neatly line up with the houses, but that's something I could have care less about. Oh, shoot. I 
I need to align it with this. Oh, it's not that bad. It's not that bad. It looks actually pretty good. Nice. Yeah, these pointy. These pointy as fuck. Um, it would be kind of fun to have like a little store here. No, not there. Just literally up here. And are we are we in for a coffee house? Because that will be ah general store. No, this was too big. Snow cone is the only thing that is like, nah, that's fine. We'll put another tree down there because trees fix everything. Or bush, for that matter. second I just realized that my mic wasn't properly adjusted to the place uh, I hope maybe the sound is now a bit different let me know if I'm too loud I realized that my microphone wasn't properly placed after all this, I'm streaming for, what, over an hour? Ah, and I only now find out I'm the worst streamer ever. Mm -hmm. Oh, it would be so cute to have, oh, tiny houses. You can fit here easily. Nothing allowed there? So she just lifts up her. It's more clear now, just a bit louder. Thanks for letting me know. I should really pay more attention to these things. I need to... Trees are the best thing in this game for placing down. But you really need to look at the base, I think. You just make everything a bit cuter. Oh, that woman was glitching. Do you look at that? Actually looks pretty green up here. Green Hill. This is crowned as Green Hill. Popsicle trees. We all love popsicle trees. Okay, that was kind of manic, but um, let's see. We have up here, we have some house stuff. So we can actually um, create another dining here, like the big one, the big one. Let's just do this. And then let's just look how much room we have left. There's a dance, oh no, not residential, commercial. Would you look at that? Space is for ages. Oh, but the rich people don't want to see that. So we need to move that over here in the corner, right? Excuse me. Thank you. Thank you. Um. Oh, it would have been perfect. Oh, you could put it here. You know, purple cinema. Because nowhere close there is a cinema. So that's quite good. But the rich people love some sochet. So let's put down the sochet. And then we have just some regular regular restaurants. Because that's a all living area. 
and the regular restaurants are like over here so we can put on another um, restaurant area um, and a bakery honestly the bakery in this game I like it but the colors this is <laughs> please Def, let me create some color schemes for you Ooh, and a barber I never place down barbers that's kind of bad um the grace you have these we can because it's all food right it's really fun to create these um seating areas that you can walk under now we have a whole terrace these lovelies and we if you just color them all different the fence is little oh, that is so cute so cute Today is really quiet in terms of people who are joining us for the stream, but I don't really care. I actually like it vibing the own game that I want. I am planning though on when in 2022, um, how is it called? Um, Two Point Campus releases. I am definitely gonna play that game easily for sure i am gonna play that game so much okay so yes i'm gonna place two of these little seating areas very close next to each other but we want to like um create the illusion um That this is all perfect and green and there are no other buildings um, near for the sake of the rich people. The little area very because now it you don't really see from the rich area all the other buildings. And this doesn't matter because it's on the other side of the river, right? and we want some let's build a memorial here randomly sometimes memorials are like in the middle of nowhere and I suddenly oh memorial it's more decoration wise but why is she skeptic why give me the reason why are you skeptic the 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 concept or um like is it just because it's a university or okay so that's really too close by do 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 Because how does she feel about Two Point Hospital? I think she like really likes that one, right? The theme of the game, yeah, okay, I can understand. But um, yeah, for myself, I'm generally in love with managing games and building games. Oh yeah, I can totally understand. Um, I have a couple of more like um, hospital games um, in my wish list that I actually really want, but they're quite expensive. But they those are more. Um, to avoid hospital has like the fun side of it, the jokes and the sarcasm, and I have two more hospital games on my wish list on steam but those don't have the funny side that much it's more realistic more management more all of that so i think i like the combination of a bit of fun and actual management but still i want to play the other games as well do, 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 do. I 
I love these little like search simulator. No, no, no. Um, let me look it up. It's uh, Project Hospital. It's 25 euros, so it's cheaper than Top One Hospital actually. Um, but it's way more realistic. Like you can even see one of the screenshots that someone like passed out in the midst of um, the hallways. But it's so much more detailed. If you've ever played, um, I don't think she has. Maybe she has. Um, if you ever played Planet Zoo, that game is also quite um, strict on how everything works. And I think Project Hospital belongs in a category of more diehard simulation and diehard management. Whereas Two Point Hospital has more fun side management as um, people pooping in the hallways, right? And then your uh, commentator being really sarcastic, like, uh, uh, please don't um, do that and stuff. Please don't. What is the sentence she says? Uh, Pages are reminded to not be in public or something. I haven't played the game actually for a while. I could quote every single sentence of the game. It was nuts. I've played it for so many hours. I don't know when that was, but there was a time that I was like crazy obsessed with the game. That was unhealthy. I think because if you actually want to like um, complete every level like three stars you actually need to play every level for a bit longer so I think every level took me like I don't know two hours or something in the higher stages but then still on a weekend day I would like complete three four levels it was really die hard at the time because come to think of two point hospital let me grab that game two point hospital needs an update apparently but where are my achievements I can look at the achievements how far I've come so I've earned 72 gold stars divided by three. So then you know how many levels I actually did. Um, so that's 10. No, it's three, that's 10, 20, 23, 23 levels. But I'm actually like striving for every achievement in the game. So then mm, it takes you such a long time. It makes you cry. It makes you really cry if you want to get every achievement. So I always had like the um, to do on my right screen. So, oh yeah, you need to do this and this. But um, I haven't done the remix levels. Because currently you also have remix levels. And those are die hard. I cannot handle the level of stress that comes with those levels. Like, damn! Why doesn't this fit? Oh, but this fits though. No, 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 no. Do, 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 do. Oh, the perfect fit. Oh. Look at that! And then we can make a perfect pathway in between. Yes! Look at that! Oh, this is the. That's also a feature I really love about this game. So certain tiles have additional decoration that you can pick whenever you place it down. So I could also do benches. So you could, for instance, do like, oh, in the middle I want benches. Like that, I really appreciate that. I think that's a next level of thinking in a game of only less than two dollars. I think that's. It. What the fuck? You can have games that are so much more expensive 
and don't have these features. I don't get it. And these, if you do this, if you place monuments here and there, um, you will get more visitors. And I always forget about the monuments because I honestly don't like it that much. What? Why could I place it a second ago? That's a bit of the glitching in the game, I guess. Um, look how developed this town is going to look. I still have a feeling that something could be here, but you don't have to fill every single path. Um, here we have a campus. Maybe we should um, create a ne new campus very soon. To Maybe another dining though. It's perfectly. Sometimes you need to kind of like mess with everything to get the things you want. I'm so close to the next goal, guys. To the next um, achievement. I only need less than 5k. And I wanted to. Let me see. Because the campus is over there. It's one campus. So imagining that a lot of these people go here. You can have these people at the end of here. And for some reason I really like the idea. Please let me scroll. Yeah, it looks really good. I'm really pleased with how this looks. So look how far I can push this. So I want this red and like this is university and this is high school is turn. That's like the lighter purple one. And then we also have a public library. Oh, the fifth. Look at that. That's amazing. And I want a couple of um, elementary schools different kinds because you can see how small these are and I don't really care that they have a back door then you shouldn't have made uh, given everything a back door that's oh really I've played I need to move this oh no Hey! And then you move this one. And then you move... I, I don't know why it's doing that. It doesn't always do that. Bam. But indeed, for low poly it looks really good. But also like the features. You couldn't expect every game to do that for that low of a price point. I mean, as I said, there are more expensive games that don't have all these features, like small decorations and stuff. Mm. So still, I'm so pleased with this game. And yes, it is sometimes, um, glitchy at the edges but it's something I'm very easily um, how would you say that I don't really mind it for this game as it is already so so good okay so I haven't placed this one yet so I really wanted to do that um, doesn't fit here somewhere around here I want to add these parks okay this is too much more so you have some stuff here you can also get it really low like what I'm doing now some barbecues some seating area just make it really 
easily accessible and as these also have children's area i'm also creating some playgrounds actually two because i think playgrounds can never be enough I have a beautiful fountain here but the sad thing is that this is all decoration and it only provides happiness and not necessarily more people or anything so you actually need to keep looking like how well is my city doing so soon i think i need to buy one of these bad boys again so my other one is over here and this looks out over um some of the nice places so i think actually do that get a road going might actually connect these i think i need to also oh. But I also learned from my last um, playthrough, um, my other world, is don't go to neat with everything. Don't make perfect um, squares all the time. Don't make long rows. I think in the beginning, I pulled this one long, wrong, long row just to um, create this bit of um, continuity. Um, at the front of um, just so I say it, the station it was like like a big entrance but as you can see that this is very boring these long lines but actually the funnier parts are where it's all ziggy zaggy here as well this looks so much better but also here it's a bit too rectangular you want to make it fun you want to make it look good so that's something, it's actually a skill you need to develop to make everything look better. So here I have some volleyball play fields um, to get the sporting part going as well. So you have kind of a park and schools. And if you live here, you can like pick up a sport, which is really good hmm but we need to increase the money again um which is actually only in commercial cinema we already have one here hmm. i don't think we have a sushi shack quite near probably have here one what ifs a gym though Also have the exact same color. Let's, let's change the color to make that look a bit better. All the notifications. Mm -hmm. By the way, it's really fun. Um, let me place some stores again. Um, you have polyvol perks, right? So. I bought them all already because I actually played through the whole game, but you can like um, increase XP upon train arrivals or every item build, income, decreasing of costs. So that's really fun to just have these little additions in the game. It just makes it so much more interesting. And then the game doesn't get as boring as fast as some other games. My god. Why doesn't it work like that? Thank you. <laughs> I think coffee houses can never be enough. Why is it? You see, sometimes stuff is glitching. That's not the worst. Um. 
Café, Nook. Is this more of a party place? I don't know why it is glitching. Sometimes this game needs to be restarted once in a while if you've played for long runs. Hmm. I don't know what the problem is with that. Ooh, some little residentials. A bit more livelihood. At the edge, we should plant some more trees. Is there room for um, um, the bushes? Yes! We can actually create a whole freaking forest. That's amazing. Because we don't actually have to build everything full. Okay, maybe for the for the for the case for the five case, but um, I would love it if we have some room for Victorian right here. So like Gothic to watch over the mountains. This all doesn't have place for Victorian. Understandable. If we can get a couple along this really big road. Come on, boy. Come here, boy. Okay, maybe we can do this. Move this a bit aside. Yes. This is better. This is better. Oh, it actually has a... Huh? Oh, it's still... Thank you. Okay, 21. 21, that's not nice. Um, I want them to have... Um, things in the bag. Oh, this uh, yeah. Oh, well, let's see how far we can go. Every, every time I accidentally click on this, I'm just gonna walk, rock my socks off. It's really large buildings. Next to the. Da -da -da. Did I place that all in front of there? Ah, this is cute! So many people. Yes, I'm working behind. Oh, that's a little mistake. Let's cross it. Da 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 da. So big. The, look how beautiful. This part is. Okay, so now you can actually see that the forest is really straight lines. Because you think. But no, it's not that straight line. Okay. Hmm. How many trains have passed? Because that is the achievement that really bothers me. 250 trains. Because currently I've played... How long have I played this game? For how long? Eight and a half hours. Eight and a half. And how much do we still have to do? Okay, 108 trains have to pass. Come on! That's, that's too much. That's actually too much. I have to keep the game running to actually achieve that. 
No, we're not gonna bang mansions in here. Mm. We don't have any ranch homes though. I like that color a lot. That's so sad. It would be so funny if we could place that in between. Sometimes you just want to decorate it just a bit better. Sometimes the simplicity also gives a vibe. We want more commercial. Okay, so behind a... Um, this will make sense behind a um, cannot come on the word um, hotel a lot of parking space that would be amazing dun, 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 dun. okay I might get addicted on these little foresty moments Perfect spot. My hamster, um, my small little hamster, is really funny. He um, decided that he doesn't like uh, peels. So the apple peel or from a cucumber. So the bitch actually leaves everything that she does he doesn't like. I'm getting so mad about it. Because now a lot of times I'm giving some food and he won't eat the pupils of it. So then I have to watch him look if he ate everything and if he left the peels to like death and just doesn't care about it and he's all get it out of his cage because it cannot start rotting or something but the audacity of a freaking hamster a fucking hamster that normally nibbles on everything actually denies the pills so the dear things that regularly hamsters Nibble on because they're little nibblers. I really can't with the animal. And he's also starting to grow an attitude because he knows that he can be cute. He knows he can be. Oh, yeah, he is an actual diva. I can't with the animal. Looking for some things to just put down. So it's kind of getting sick of this really little town. Almost finished though. I think I'm gonna do more. Because this is then the um, hotel in the midst of commercial area. That's really cool. So just to get that value up. Why can I not? We'd say so. I want kind of like an outgoing area here. It's 
some coffee shops at the other side. Come on. Increase that value, baby. No, no. Okay, so if possible, for decoration's sake, it'd be lovely to put down a park. Oh no. One. So let's get that around. You spin my head right round, right round. Come on. Please. More trees. Thank you. So now we still have a bit of a green area. And then on the other road, we have the commercial area. All the restaurants. We can get donuts. We can get food. Um, decoration. I want. Yes. The pavilion in the back. And even an arcade. Oh no. I clicked that so many times wrong. You could even like rent a boat here. It's got a little bit of road. Roads. And then it actually walks up to the edge. That is actually really nice. And the money just keeps flowing into my pocket. Because this game is ridiculous in terms of money. You don't have any money in your issues in this game. <laughs> Oh, maybe we should also do a bit more. 122, yes, that's what we're talking about, baby. <laughs> I really like the... Um, split office. I think that actually care, cares for a lot of money intake. You just, oh. Like business, big business. Mm -hmm. Like a business area and everything. Can we? I'm gonna put as many down as possible. This is gonna be the money district, baby. Not that many business, but we also have the small business buildings. <laughs> That's actually babies in comparison to the bigger ones. Small babies, small. Look at the babies. Then we're gonna skip a part. Oh no. Actually, cannot place anything down. I think the achievement with how many um, um, 
trains pass by should have been put down to 200 because this is not manageable to actually play the game like full hardly like I do I'm not gonna get it I get all the little businesses small and growing Aww. to look wherever we can put trees 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 we want more trees actually the money district we're at 2.3 i can definitely definitely smell the one achievement So close. Oh, space. Look at that. Then with the green behind it, it actually looks fairly cool. Hey, thank you for being there. Have a nice night. Sleep well. Sleep tight. Yes, we will see each other soon. We'll, um, I don't think we have anything planned, but I'll be sure that we make uh, another appointment. Bye! Will do! our quests on all the little uh, I want to make this whole round only and only with little industrial buildings look at that and then we're gonna plant more trees behind it everything that we can to create a beautiful, beautiful um, area. We can indeed also add palm trees. I haven't added these here yet. I think these are a lovely addition. Do it. Let's see, we're almost done with all the trees. Uh, we just want to add a couple more where possible. Look at that, we have actually have a lovely inside area. It actually looks really, really good. So we're at 23.6 thousand. We just need a bit more, so we gotta focus on commercial if we wanna make this happen on this island. We don't have that much space left, so I don't know if we can actually pull this off. We might ch need to change a couple of things here and there. Um, let's see. We're gonna make another recreational area right here. Um, actually gets 108 so it would be lovely if we put down another cinema it's like easy to get the achievement if you just um put all the most expensive items in of course but we're not gonna be like that no sure we're gonna look how much we can actually pull off so commercial uh we actually have a big diner very close by i believe well, it's there. So I am agreeing with putting down another dining in a different color. So that's 137. Um, so I don't know why I did not finish this off with another of these. And a 
another one here because there's a perfect slope um, for that actually. Okay. So we're at 24,000. We only need 800. So here's a perfect spot for the hot doggery. That's 95. Uh, we have some one block, so let's add some fries in there. 15 of leaves with 700. Um, there is a sushi restaurant over there, but I'm gonna put another one down. <laughs> if we are really careful, we can actually, I think, put down quite some stuff in here still. I know I'm gonna push it a lot actually. Because these are not too much, but every single bit helps. So this is gonna be more of an industrial being. So this is actually done for. Okay, now we're gonna put another one of these and another hot doggery. How digger damn. Because where's the other hot doggery? Oh, that's over there. That's fine. So this is pure harsh industry. I'm not gonna lie. I'm gonna kind of cheat right here with a very large ice cream row. This is gonna be the the ice cream alley of the city. We made it! We already made it. Okay, so I want to finish this off. So let's just decorate it. Ah, oh, we got the achievement. So there's a lot of exercise and stuff. And there's a hotel. So we want something to do. Which you put down there. Let's put down some bushes. And what are we gonna put down here? I hope a little park. I don't think I've put enough of these parks in, so this will be a little parky area. It is kind of in line with this, but then these people can lovely sit. We can put down these small paths. Uh, if we put it on a four, we can actually make beautiful pathways. Is the most linear? It's most certainly not. But it creates the illusion that everything is connected. Okay, we create a little memoriam. Little seating areas here and there. Boop. Boop. And then some blossoming trees. This is amazing. But as this game, so now I'm gonna speed the game up. Because the only thing left is the trains. Because this city is complete. I'm gonna make some couple of more screenshots. Bye. So I didn't realize I was this far with the achievement. We only need 102 more train arrivals. So I might do that off stream because the only place we have left is Polyville Island, which I'm gonna make off stream because the last achievement is simply just landing the um, 
drains pass. So as that is the only thing left for me to do, this game will be running offline. Well, for me offline. Um, because I will do something else in the meantime. But anyway, thank you so much for joining the stream. Um, let me know what you think of the game. And I will get you guys at the next stream. Bye guys. Love you. Mm-hmm. <laughs>